When us lizard owners go out to buy crickets, we usually look at them and think, huh, that is food for my lizard. But there are some really cool facts about crickets that I think you should know, so today I'm going to be sharing a few of them with you. I'll be teaching you how to tell the gender of a cricket just by a quick glance. I'll be teaching you how crickets chirp. And finally, and most excitingly in my opinion, I'll teach you how to tell what temperature it is just by listening to a cricket's chirp. Despite what some people might think in that it's their wings and if they have them, they're males, that, that's not true. Instead, you have to look at the end of their abdomen and that long, dark colored stick is actually called an ovipositor. And ovi means egg and positor is derived from deposit, so it literally means egg depositor. So as you can imagine, only females have these. The ovipositor is a hollow tube and they stick it into the soil and lay eggs through it. To compare, here is a male. They still have the two prongs near the end of their abdomen, but they do not have the ovipositor in between them, and that would extend out further anyway, so that's how you can tell that this is a boy. Now, only the male crickets will chirp to attract the females, so if you're easily annoyed by chirping crickets, just ask for females. Not every pet store is going to pick out the females for you, but if you're nice and you only want like six or so, they'll probably do it. Cricket fact number two, which I'm filming on a separate day as you can see because I ran out of time yesterday. Anyway, fact number two is a lot of people think crickets chirp using their legs, but that is not true. Instead, they chirp using their wings. One side of the wing has teeth-like ridges on it, and the other side is a stiffened edge, and like running your thumb down the teeth of a comb, they use their wings and rub them together to make the chirping noise. One more cool cricket fact for you. Did you know you can determine the temperature it is outside just by listening to the crickets chirp? First count how many chirps you hear in 15 seconds and then add that to 37 and the end number is the temperature in Fahrenheit that it is where that cricket is. So as you can imagine, as the temperature goes up, the cricket chirps more frequently. Try it at home, you'll find that it's surprisingly accurate. The ovipositor, oh, don't jump out. Nope, 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 nope. Uh. Really, crickets? There is one annoying cricket that found his way underneath the dishwasher and there's no way I'm gonna be able to get him. 